right now i'm running a new giveaway where i'm going to be giving away free gold bars to five people in red dead redemption 2 online so if you want to win 55 gold bars in red dead online all you have to do is subscribe to my channel drop a like on this video and comment why you want to win also guys make sure you hit the bell notification on my channel so you know when i'm going to announce the winner What's up guys, my name is Volatile and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel and I hope you guys are having an amazing day as always. Anyways guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get yourself a limited amount of money in Red Dead Redemption 2 online. So if you do want to find a glitch useful then do drop a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be uploading daily Red Dead Redemption 2 online content. Also guys, this video is sponsored by U4N once again, and if you guys want to buy yourself $1 million on Red Dead Redemption with a load of other additional items, then click the link in the description down below or the link that is, will be pinned in the comments section below. Also guys, use the discount code VOLATILE for 5% off your purchase. You can also purchase other items on the website such as Fortnite weapon packages for Save the World and other items for other games too. I also forgot to shout out Aziz for the nice comment on my previous videos and if you'd like to get a shout out too then drop a nice comment and you may appear in my next video. Anyways guys in today's video to get yourself a limited amount of money in Red Dead Redemption 2 online then just go ahead and head off to Blackwater or try and fast travel to Blackwater if you can. Once you have reached to Blackwater guys you can just try and make your way to this little pond in Stillwater Creek and I'm going to point an arrow which one because I forgot to drop a waypoint on this location but aside from that guys yes this has been out for almost a week but trust me it is still by far one of the best glitches right now that is still currently working so if you guys want to profit a lot then you can try this glitch out for yourself and tell me if it worked for you guys. Now once you arrive at this location, what you want to do is just get off your horse and take out your fishing rod near the pond. Then once you've done that, simply just place some bait on the fishing rod and it does not matter which bait you put on your fishing rod. From here, just go ahead and throw your bait into the water and wait till the fish is hooked and onto the bait and from here, just reel the fish in. You can also go into dead eye mode by pressing L3 and R3 analog sticks together and from here you will see that the fish will begin to spawn in the pond and it took me at least like two or three tries to catch the fish with the rod before I actually saw any fish spawn in dead eye mode but once you do see the fish spawn in and you've caught your fish what you need to do is just run around inside the lake and what this does is that it just scares the fish in onto the land. The pond is so small that whenever you run inside the pond the fish will get scared and what it will do it will just instantly die when it reaches on land because it will try and go away from you and when this does happen you can just quickly pick up free and easy three star fish from the floor sometimes the fish even goes on the land themselves without you even having to try and scare them so just keep going in dead eye mode to see if you've missed some fish on the floor still now you can do this until you've reached the maximum capacity of fish in your inventory for each fish that you pick up and in this pond you can actually catch all types of fish like largemouth bass, smallmouth bass, redfin pickerel, the chain pickerel and many other types of fish as well that you can go ahead and sell to the butcher. Now this glitch is a very easy and lazy method to gain the most money and the fastest way but once in a while the fish may despawn after like 10 minutes maybe and if you do still need more fish to pick up into your inventory then you can just take your fishing rod out and simply catch another fish to spawn all the fish back into the pond. This glitch also improves your honor level so if you've been using the cop killing XP glitches like me then you have the maximum negative honor level and if you really want to have a higher honor level then this is the way to go as well because you are being resourceful for each fish that you go ahead and pick up you will gain positive honor 
I spent around like 10 minutes maybe in this spot alone and no one came to me but if you do see someone that is already there then try and be civilized and not kill each other because there is plenty of fish for everyone to pick up and it is also a limited guy so you don't have to worry about losing any fish so because they will do spawn back again but if someone is there and you're both killing each other the best thing the best solution for this will be just to quickly go into a new free roam lobby that until you find one that is empty and you can just go ahead and use this glitch to your advantage you guys can also get dynamites from the weapon store and from here when there is a load of fish in one spot you can throw them in the pond and this will give you so much xp for each fish that you kill and not only that you'll be able to do your dynamite challenge which will give you even more xp so this glitch can be used for xp and money as well so it's really op in my opinion but right now in this video i did not have any dynamite so i could not show you that the dynamite method also works but you guys can try it for yourselves and tell me down in the comment section below that it worked for you and i would love that comment i'll pin it and like it or whatever anyways guys after a good 10 minutes of picking up all this fish i did check my inventory and i saw that my satchel was basically full already so what i did was i headed back into the blackwater butcher which is very close too so you do not need to travel much distance to sell your fish and return to the glitch spot again so that is good as well a quick trick for you guys as well is to take note is that whenever you're traveling somewhere and your horse is nearly exhausted what you can do is repeatedly hold your l3 analog stick down and what this does is it calms your horse down and it also regens your horse's stamina back so you don't need to slow down and wait for your horse to catch his breath again because you can carry on sprinting with your horse while it's gaining its own stamina back some people didn't know this uh, some people didn't know about this and if you didn't know about it and you're one of them people and you found it useful then do drop a like for that awesome trick that you guys know for the future also guys once i did arrive at the butcher someone came up to me and tackled me and they ended up killing me but not to worry because if you do get killed then you won't be losing anything at all because you don't have any pelt on you or your horse for them to steal and sell and basically the fish does remain in your inventory no matter how many times you die so i went back and just killed them and i even stole their carcass and i sold it to the butcher for extra money for wasting my time but you know the police killed me before i even got the chance to go to the butcher and sell it but you know when i did respawn i just went ahead picked up the carcass and just sold it for extra money and that's cool as well so like if someone's killing you and they're wasting your time you can just go ahead and steal their stuff but I don't really advise it because, you know, just try and be as civilized as you can. But now once I did sell all the other items to the butcher, I will begin with the blue f gill fish, which I had 10 of. And this gave me $7.50. And then after I sold all of them, I had 10 redfin pickerels, which gave me $10, which is $1 for each fish that I sold. Then onto the six chain pickerels, which gave me $6. And again, a dollar for each of those fishes that... That I picked up and then I sold the 10 largemouth basses and they went for two dollars this time so I gained twenty dollars just from picking 10 of those fish up and finally I did sell the 10 rock bass and I gained ten dollars for that which was obviously one dollar for each fish that I picked up so from just these fish that I had picked up I gained fifty three dollars and fifty cents alone in about ten minutes after adding all of them up that I sold and additionally when i did sell other meat as well and carcass too i gained probably about 60 dollars i'm not really sure but you know you guys can do the maths and you guys can check it for yourself but yeah this glitch is by far the fastest and the best in my opinion so you guys should try this out for yourself and keep doing it because it is currently still working as of today's date and yeah that does wrap up for today's video if you guys did enjoy the video and did find it useful then do drop a like and subscribe to my channel because it does motivate me to upload more daily red dead redemption 2 online content for you guys and don't forget that you can get yourself 1 million de red dead dollars in game currency with many more features from u4n.com and you can use my discount code volatile to get yourself 5% off also guys don't forget that i'm still running my giveaway and yes i did not upload for a while because i've been very very busy with my college assignments so don't worry i am still going to run this giveaway because when i do hit 10,000 subscribers uh, i will be picking five winners so you know go ahead you might be the next lucky winner that will get yourself 55 gold bars when i hit 
10,000 subscribers so just follow the rules that were at the beginning of the video which is to subscribe to my channel drop a like on this video comment why you want to win and then finally what you need to do is just press the bell notification and turn it on and so that you guys can be notified when I do announce the giveaway winner and you could also be one of the active people which will have a higher chance of winning the giveaway anyways guys that does wrap up for today's video my name is volatile and i'm out goodbye